just, just pour it in. Pour it in everywhere. No, 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 no. Oh, well, it was in the sauce. I meant in the. Oh man. <laughs> oh my gosh. We gotta cut this is all fine. We gotta cut that. Oh, hey, I didn't see you there. I'm Sophia Rowe, and today we're letting a very special person, all pro defensive back Derwin James, finally get in the kitchen to cook with me. That's right, the man loves cheese, the man loves hot sauce, and frankly, he's gonna put the gridiron to the cast iron. You know what I'm saying? This isn't a drill, this isn't a game. This is Let Him Cook, presented by State Farm. Nice to meet you. I am so grateful that you're here. This is so a token of my appreciation. We have your apron. You ready? I need that. Oh, Got yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Appreciate yep. that. Go ahead, do a spin for me. Come Turn on around. Now, so, sure. you're a steak fan, yes? Yes, yeah, steak, macaroni, stuff like that. Do you eat steak and macaroni often? This is like one of my favorite meals. Like Wait, do you cook a lot? I'm not the best cook in the world. Okay. I can grill, but I'm not really much of a cooker like in the kitchen. But you come from a big barbecue kind of grill family, yes? Oh yeah, my dad's really the one that can get down in, in the really? kitchen. Really? From what I understand, he would like grill for your football games. Oh yeah, As during the football games, growing uh -huh. up, I just used to always remember just him, him cooking, you know, just being able to smell those steaks, yep. just dying to get off the field, you know, <laughs> to run over there towards the tent. Oh, so here's the thing, yeah. you're a barbecue sauce fan. Yeah. You cannot honestly tell me that you're gonna put barbecue sauce on this steak. Barbecue sauce on everything. <laughs> Like, I try to stay away from it, but chicken, what? steak. So I wanted to like take it back to the days where you're like, dad was like grilling at your football games and you're gonna barbecue sauce me like that? No, nah, I'm, I'm gonna taste a piece of it without it just to make sure. <laughs> and then oh, okay. after that, Okay. If it's if it's talking about something, and then that's okay. when the barbecue sauce, okay. it may come in, you know? Okay, so today we're gonna do a steak and mac personalized just for you. Just like the State Farm personal price plan. <laughs> Now go get that steak. Eat yeah, that. You know that's it. That's it. Where you at? Where you at? Hello. Hey. Hey. For the cast iron steak, we got butter, garlic, thyme, and rosemary. So we've got some neutral oil in the pan. See, that pan is Sizzle. hot. That's, uh, it's good. Yeah, that's that pan is nice and hot. Steak, yeah. we're going to just pop it down. Before you put it on the... What? Can I ask you questions about how you cook your steak? You're going to wait till right now? Yeah, that's, that's what makes it better. All right, ask me. Ask away. How long do you leave it on each side? The answer should be medium rare. No, Eat. medium well. Oh my gosh. Medium rare? Medium well? You might as well just eat it like it that. Is, well, just eat it. That's what I'm saying. You might as well eat it like that. You talking about medium medium you're rare? You're telling me you're gonna take this. Medium rare, you might as well eat it like that. Maybe I will. Come on now. All right, I'll make I can't believe Come on this. Now. Only for you. If you don't eat your steak medium well or medium plus, you missing out. Come on now. She gotta show me. <laughs> I'm now. about to do a burnt <laughs> steak for y'all. Well, well, since we finna burn a steak, let's do it. All right. That's well. probably why I like the barbecue sauce so much, huh? That is why you like the barbecue sauce, because, because it's Burn. Okay, I'm sorry. I know you the chef, and uh, I know. Please, it's fine. I, it's fine. Bad. I love you. I forgive you. It's fine. I'm it's, doing it it's only all for good. you. Appreciate that. But at home, medium rare is the standard. <laughs> all right, drop it down. Yeah. And since you want this medium well, yeah. we're gonna leave it here. Smelling so you pretty. can kind of peek. You can see. see? Oh yeah, that's burning pretty quick though. It's cooking really fast. Yeah. It's got your little burn. Yeah. Mark no, we're that good. You like. For people at home, what I would do is two minutes, flip, two minutes. That's gonna give you medium rare. Medium rare. That ain't cooking good <laughs> enough. Rare. Yeah, that ain't, that ain't cooking. <laughs> but if you want it medium or medium rare. Three well, minutes, right? It'll be three minutes. Hey. It's, listen. What'd it say? Three. Three the lucky number. Three minutes each side if you want the perfect steak, I'm telling you. Again, in honor of DJ Personal, Jess Braham. <laughs> we just yeah. wanna kinda create a little bit more flavor. Yeah. So we're gonna drop this down, butter, and then herbs. What the herbs give it a little more flavor? Absolutely. See, this is the part I'm missing on my steak. And see, we're gonna come here, and then you're gonna baste it. Yeah. You see that? This is what I do after with the barbecue sauce, but you're doing <laughs> while you while you cooking it, so it makes it it makes it better. I, I see. Do you wanna give it a try? Oh it's yeah. Hot. Oh yeah. Spoon. And you're gonna just take it and so spoon it. That's it. Yeah, that's it. I see you had it at the angle about right there. About that's good. Eleven o'clock. Literally, it's perfect. Hey. <laughs> Chef James in here now. We in here. Hey, we in here now. No, you're a pro. So nah, when are you gonna nah, open nah, up nah. the restaurant? It's real soon. Let's go. Real soon. Let's go. I'll be there with these we in the work. steaks. We in the work. <laughs> okay, it's gorgeous. So I'm gonna take this and we're gonna let this rest 
The crazy. oven is not on. Why are you letting it rest? Because you want all the juices inside your steak. Okay. If you were to just cut into a steak right after it's cooked, yeah. the juices are going to be all over your cutting board. And yeah. you don't want that. You want the juices in the steak. So letting it rest yeah. puts the juices back where you want them. So how long you leave it? 15 minutes minimum. Yeah. For medium rare. Now, so, for you. No, I'm going be... three. I already told you the number already. We're back home. It's, <laughs> it's, it's three. Three, three, three. 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 Rest for 15. Rest for 15. That's the Absolutely. formula. <laughs> Yeah. And that's enough for us to kind of get going on our mac. For the macaroni and cheese, we've got heavy cream, mustard powder, and four kinds of cheeses. Extra sharp cheddar, Monterey Jack, Gruyere, and grated Parmesan. We've got water boiling. Elbow, thick OG. We're gonna put that <laughs> in. Eight to 10 minutes al dente. We're gonna do some breadcrumbs. Grab me some butter. I got you. Please. Hey, we back. We back, y'all. We getting the butter. Okay, so this is cheese, so I'm gonna have you put that back and grab me the butter that's on top. Oh, my bad. It's good. Oh, man. I mixed Great. that up. Love that it. makes it even better. Okay. <laughs> okay. For now, we're gonna do these breadcrumbs. And then here, what we're looking for is like a nice golden brown. You wanna try? Yeah. Do something like this? Yeah, I can do that. All right, let's can... see if you can do it. Hold on. Oh, that's good. Do you have a little more energy? All right, it's gonna come out the pot, man. No, come on, come on. Get it in there. All right, there we go. Okay, you might hey, be a chef. Hey, 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 we chefing it up. What? That looks good. We're gonna get the hang of it. I'll just keep going. That's good. Oh, see? <laughs> I'll be talking too soon. All right, you see. got too excited. <laughs> Let me see. All right, that is just gonna sit there, and we are gonna make what is called a bechamel. What it is? It's like the base for our cream sauce. Okay. So we're gonna cook some butter, milk, and flour together. So. I need you to go to the refrigerator. I'm gonna make sure I grab the right thing this time. <laughs> Butter and milk. You, you want the big it. milk or the small milk? The yeah. big milk. Love it. Okay, cute. And then butter. All right, bet. I'm gonna make sure I don't bring the cream cheese this time. I don't think it's no more butter. I know. This, I said this was cheese before because I wanted you to go in to the fridge. I was messed up. See, you done messed me up for the rest of the show, rest of the town messed up. Because now she got me thinking butter is cheese. I told you it was cheese because I would be funny. See, see what I'm saying? Well, I knew I went in there and got the right thing, too. That's what's crazy. Yeah, you Each did. One. Yeah, see? All right, all that's right. Up. That's messed up. All right, up, my right. bad, my bad, my bad. First is butter. This flour? Yeah. Put that in. Okay. And I'm going to whisk it. All right, bet. Okay, so milk. So I'm going to whisk, you're going to pour. Cool. All right, stop. We're gonna keep whisking. And then, back to the fridge. Yeah. Cheese time. All right, you ain't tricking me this time. Oh, uh, no. I know what cheese look like. <laughs> she is not tricking me this time. <laughs> you are so funny. <laughs> okay, so we have multiple cheeses. So you're just gonna grate it over this plate. Okay. Hey, I'm doing it, y'all. Honestly, you're nailing it. Oop, well, you, you know, he was nailing too it. Too strong, it's yeah. Fine. It's like, uh... There we go. Hey, you gotta, like, you, not too <laughs> strong, but you gotta take some of the strength it's true. out of it. Like, yes. You feel me? I think I got a lot of cheese over here now. <laughs> this is enough. You ain't told me it was enough yet. That's an incredible amount of cheese. Okay, pour cheese. All right, we're gonna just, just pour it in. Pour it in everywhere. Then. No, 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 no. Oh, well, it was in the sauce. I meant in the. Oh man. <laughs> oh my gosh. We gotta cut. This that. is all fine. We gotta cut that. No, we are gonna save this. We gotta cut. It's nope. We are not cutting. We are not cutting. My bad, y'all. I, I might... messed the I messed the macaroni <laughs> up, man. Can't. If you still can make this good after this, then... I promise. Okay, okay, yeah. So the rest of that, into here. All right, cool. Yeah, I should have been a little See, clearer. See, you telling me to go I know, you I wasn't, noodles out there fresh? I wasn't... You're right. See? My bad. I ain't blaming you. I, ain't I no wasn't clear. <laughs> <laughs> That's still going to taste good. Yeah, for sure. Okay, good. at some point, you're going to have to go back to the fridge. What I need out of here? There should be a heavy cream. Is there, like, a little milk? Oh, yeah, I see the... You uh, see that little yeah, one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring it over. Okay, now more cheese. So this cheese uh, into here. It's going there. No, no, nothing in there. Dude, uh, this is like bad zone. Uh, I bet. Nothing in there. I bet. With this mix? Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah, and then maybe we could uh, keep yeah. shredding that. If it's not really shredding that good. No, nah, huh? look, you gotta get oh, smarter. Oh, look at you. That's hey, new. I just taught you something. That's I'm telling you, you, <laughs> you can't cut the finger. It's the only way. Okay, yeah. that's good. Now all the cheese. Uh, Put all the cheese in. Oop, uh, did I just. Yeah, you got me. Oh. See? See, we in here. Oh my. We're making a big mess. Oh my God. See, I can't be scared to make a mess in here. You can't. Just make a mess and like live it's, with the results, like, you know? It's true. Uh, keep whisking. All right. Whisk, 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 whisk. So like, what do you do with football? Like, what's your position? What does it do? Uh, I play defense and uh, basically my job is to stop people from scoring touchdowns. That's a really important job. Yeah. Okay, pour that all over the noodles. All right, bet. Mm. Yo! That 
Ooh. You can't miss the corners. You got to get in them corners. Ooh. And then you can get the middle. You feel me? And then what we're going to do is we're going to take these breadcrumbs on top. Yeah. We're going to put this in the oven for about 20 minutes, 400 degrees. We're going to get our steak, our mac. Let's eat. I know you're hungry. Let's eat. I know you're hungry. Let's go. I know. Let's go. <laughs> Wow. I ain't trying to hype you up, but I ain't know it was gonna look like this. Look how good it's like pulling. Gorge, look at the crunch. Stop. Wow, what a <laughs> shot. Wow. <laughs> okay, go ahead, try it. Yeah, for sure. Oh my God, it's hot. That is a big bite. Oh yeah. So I've got barbecue sauce and hot sauce here for you. I don't even need it. Stop, are you kidding? I don't need it. We'll see. I, if I can graduate you from barbecue sauce on a steak. That's good. Okay, so we did this. I have you eating a steak without slathering it in barbecue sauce. No shade to yeah. barbecue sauce. Yeah. So I feel like this is like, I don't know, like this could be a win, but we have to name it first. I say we gotta name it D3 Steak and Mac. So how would you rate this? I'll give it a 12 out of 10. It's definitely 12 okay. out of 10? For me not to use barbecue sauce on it should already let you know, like, what it is. I didn't need it, so I want to say thank you. Aww. Hey, I'm going <laughs> to eat, though. I don't know about Oh, my God. Well, you heard it here, folks. D3 Steak and Mac, he approves. For sure, for sure. Yes, and if you want to make this recipe yourself, you can check out the entire recipe, full thing, at length, in the description below. Thank you so much, DJ, for being here. It really means a lot. Mm -hmm. And thank you so much for watching. And that's... Let them go. go! Presented by State Forum. <laughs>